Hey guys, welcome back to Phys Ed Universe. I'm Coach Polly. Today we're going to be continuing our track and field unit. It's the second part of a three-part series. We'll be working on long jump and triple jump. Now again, this is how I teach it to elementary kids. It's not a way to get these kids to become high school track athletes. It's just a way to introduce them to the sport. Before we get into it, please like, subscribe, and share. Now, let's take a look. Okay, first things first, I would teach kids how to perform the long jump. The way that I have them do it is, I would split them into four separate groups. Each group has a hula hoop, as we have here. The group would stand in a straight line behind a particular hula hoop. They would run as fast as they can towards that hula hoop, put one foot in it, jump as far as they can, and land, and that would be their mark. Now, there are several points of emphasis. Number one, you've got to run as fast as you can. Number two, when you jump, jump as high as you can because the longer you're in the air, the further you're going to go. Also, you cannot jump from outside the hula hoop. For example, you could not jump from here. You have to have one foot in the hula hoop and jump off of that foot only. Now, I'll give you a demonstration, but remember, I'm an old man, so give me a grace. Run foot, jump, land, that would be my mark. Then I would let them practice for a little bit before we competed. The way I have them compete is I simply have them sit against my stage. Then one at a time, they run from the stage, jump out of the hula hoop as far as they can. I take the cone, I mark where they landed, and that's how I would keep up with first, second, and third place, adjusting accordingly when people get beat. Now you only get one jump, so if a kid were to run, step outside the hula hoop and jump from there, that's a scratch, that jump doesn't count, and we would move on to the next person. Very simple, it's quick to get through. Now, let's take a look at triple jump. For triple jump, the approach is the exact same. You wanna run from the stage as fast as you can, one foot in the hula hoop for your first jump. Now, as the name implies in triple jump, there are three separate jumps, and you have two different options. You could jump right foot, right foot, left foot, land, or you could jump left foot, left foot, right foot, land. Either way, the first two jumps have to come off the same foot. The last jump comes off the opposite foot, and where you land after the third jump is your mark. Again, I'll give you a demonstration. <clears throat> I'm going to go right foot, right foot, left foot, land. Right, right, left, land. That would be my mark. Again, after this, I'd give them some time to practice. Then we would compete in the exact same way that we competed in long jump. Again, guys, that's the second part of a three-part series. Next week, we'll be sprinting and distance running. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And until next time, play hard and make a difference.